Hey everyone, Miasity here. Welcome back. Today, with Zug Zug, we're going to be starting Remnant from the Ashes 2. So let's get down to the brass tacks, create our character, and get to multiplayer and start a fun new game. We're going to be going male. Is this voices? Not bad. Not a very bad squeaky all. voice. I could use that. I don't know what all this is, but I do not want to find out. I don't know what all this is. But I don't want to find out. Well, I don't know what all this is, but I I don't want to find out. Not really, fan. Most of these. I don't like the looks of this. All right. Whoa, that was kind of a <laughs> odd little red thing there. Sure. I turn them very, very slowly. Okay, we are not having a man bun. Sure. A little too gray. Wish there was a little bit of a slider there. Yeah, we can go with that. And scars, markings. Ooh, some of these are some nasty gashes. Sure. Not gonna get too far into that. I think me and Zug Zug decided to go on Survivor for our first playthrough. And then if we really enjoy the game, we'll move up from there. I do like how Apocalypse just says, good luck. <laughs> Survivor, a solid starting point for most players, veteran, more demanding experience with tougher and deadlier enemies, a great choice for players that enjoy a challenge, nightmare, ruthlessly difficult, Designed for fully geared players with strong builds and a desire for unforgiving experience, not recommended as a starting point. So definitely not starting there, we're going Survivor. <laughs> Do you wish to create your character with these settings? Yes. So I'm guessing that we're going to be selecting a class later. There's our kind of trademark crystal. Pretty beautiful so far. If I wanted to feel sorry for myself, I'd have stayed with your father. Oh, no, that is quite a drop. Let me help you down. I've got this. life. The sinkhole, your foot. What? You'd be dead if my mom hadn't taught me to dress a wound. Fine. Two times then. The sinkhole and just now. Hey, let me see that. Leave it. It's nothing. Hey, I'm fine. That yeah, doesn't look good. Roll up your sleeve and just admit we're friends already. This is not an admission. Hey, let me see. <sighs> uh, it's getting worse. Listen, it ain't broken or bleeding. It'll calm down. It always does. <sighs> Let's go. Kid said the ward was this way. Root run? Session will be joinable after completing the tutorial. Okay. You ever hear about the North Pole? Huh. That old fairy tale? Yeah. Like this ward. Old white guy founds it. Food and fresh water, everyone gets along. <laughs> that sounds like the fairy tale to me. It's probably just a couple of old timers holed up underground. I just hope they got a few supplies for trade. Otherwise, we won't last much longer out here. <laughs> I 
You think people actually live like this? Uh, <laughs> I don't know, not sure. I don't know what's in that folk from the original <laughs> blend, but I never seen nobody that happy before. Not in real life. <laughs> yeah. Give me a cup of that. Okay, now I can run. The end of gun. Not much of a tutorial. It's not really showing me much here. Locked. Great. Ugh, we can't turn back now. Ain't got nowhere to go. There's gotta be another way through. Hey, Eagle Eye. See if you can squeeze your ass through that hole up there. Sure, get the guy with the injured foot to do that. <laughs> Simple lock. Bolt. It's about time. What took you? Ooh, shiny. Hey, look at this. What happened to these poor bastards? Yeah, I, I already got it. Hey, come on. Let's get some distance between us and these guys. <sighs> Over here! <sighs> That's one rusty door. Alright. Once again, the tutorial is not actually saying to do much. There we go. This does not look good. Oh, this is bad. This is bad with a side of broccoli. A side of what? Nothing. Uh, something my mom used to say. <laughs> bad with a side of broccoli. Shooting. Hey, that don't count, by the way. Anything over here? No. Okay, fine. I have to drop. Uh, I'm uh, starting to think looking for this ward wasn't such a good idea. Yeah, me too. She is alive. This does not look good. Guess the deadwood ain't all gone after all. No. Nope. Ain't no way the war's real. Not with a nest like this out here. You know, maybe best we head back. I don't think we can head back. Retrace our steps. We can find another way out. Oh boy.
Oh no. Now, quick, put a bullet in all their heads. It's okay. You're safe. Whoa, whoa, hold up. We're friends. We're here to help. Uh, can't hold this forever, Bo. Dragonheart? Thanks. Who, who are you? Questions later. We gotta get moving. On three. Still got each other. <laughs> right. Follow us, you two. That won't be the last of them. Well, best bet we got. <sighs> Root or thick down here. Must be what I felt back at the ward. Wait. <laughs> From the ward? Shit. <coughs> Maybe Santa's real too. <laughs> yeah, it's not far from here. But the way down collapsed behind us. We're gonna have to find another way out. Maybe Santa's real too, huh? At least I can one shot these guys. Oh, right. Once I actually see them. I think they'll get my back. Shade. 
think they're just feeding me more because there's four people now. And I am very low on ammo. Something you don't say. The dead would know they've lost, but they won't lay down without a fight. Oh. Than I want Almost got him. Oh, he can throw stuff. I'm not gonna punch it. Go crazy. Shooting traveler. Yeah, I had some practice. I'll bet. But don't worry. Your ward's as safe a place as any. Safer. So it's really real. Food and water and folks living with some old white guy? <laughs> More or less. Her thing's getting worse. <laughs> it's spreading to her neck. Let me get you some water. Ooh, that looks like root rot. I've never seen a case this bad. I'm fine. I don't know why everyone... We need to get her to work. And quick. Doctor, there's her only chance. We'd better get moving. Before we lose the light. Yeah, it's spreading fast. So they're above ground now? Interesting. Rig. I got you, darling. Don't worry, friend. We'll take good care of her. Welcome to War 13. Hey, don't worry. Riggs is right. She'll be fine. Are you okay? Just a headache. Hey, hey, Clementine. Uh, let me get you some water. I'm fine. Oh, you're not fine. You need rest. Bo!
He's the ward's mayor. Thinks that puts him in charge of everything and everyone. Listen, I'm gonna check in with Ford, and then I'll get some rest, okay? I've been through a lot worse, you know. All right, let's see what this is so, about. Uh, traveler, um, <clears throat> your friend will be fine. I'm Bo, Bo Ward, and this is Ward 13. He must have come a long way. I mean, the route's dwindling and all, but the road's still a dangerous place. What were you two doing out there? Well, we were looking for you. Really? Huh. I didn't know anybody knew what we were doing here. <laughs> We've just, uh... You know, we've been cut off from the world for so long that, well, I'm surprised people know about us outside the gate. Feels kind of nice, actually. Hey, ask around if you need something. Oh, start with Ford. I'm sure he'd like to meet you. All right, let's uh, let's find Ford. Audrey, I, uh, I've been meaning to tell you something. You sounded so much like Brad just now. Uh, sorry. What did you want to say? Oh, I, I... You remind me so much of him. You mean... And I'm guessing I need to go over there. Yep. Okay. This is not up for discussion, Clementine. You're staying, and that's final. I don't remember asking for your permission. Watch your tone, young lady. Excuse me? I'm 132 years old, in case you forgot. What? And I am not your child. You don't have authority over me. On this, I do. This town needs you. You can't go wandering off after something that... that might not even exist. Oh, that's rich. What have you been doing the last hundred years then, huh? What the hell are you doing right now? Well, that's different. I'm trying to fix things. Things that you broke when you tried to play God. I was Horace Guard. I was just following orders. I didn't. Oh, and that makes it okay. You know how many people died because you just followed orders. That yes, rich. You think I don't remember that every goddamn day? I'm trying to make things right here. So am I. You're such a damned hypocrite, Ford. If I leave, it's my fault. But you? You didn't break the world. You didn't run after a pipe dream. You didn't abandon your family a dozen times over. <sighs> Look, I've made a lot of mistakes. I admit that. But it's because of those mistakes that I'm telling you not to do the same thing. <sighs> well, forgive me if I don't want to take advice from the men who fucked up the world in the first place. Ouch. I'm not your dreamer anymore. What? Maybe I've got my own mission. These people need you, Clementine. You're too important to just... Every person out there is capable of taking care of themselves. This isn't about them. It's about you. You've always run away from your problems, but you won't let me run toward something. What are you so goddamned afraid of? I'm losing you. Losing them. Losing everything. She's the dreamer. Everything! You took it from me. You, Neville Harsgard. The whole goddamned project. I don't belong here. I never did. I'm tired of pretending I do look uh, <laughs> you through a lot today you're tired get some rest huh things will feel better tomorrow no they won't you know how I you know I used to look up to you the way you seemed strong enough to save the world except I've already saved it haven't I? And what have you done? I... <sighs> I can't let you go near that place, Clementine. That's an order. <laughs> you haven't learned a damned thing, Ford. Out of my way. 
Yowch. So she is the dreamer, huh? I always thought the dreamer was male. Here's Ford. Whoa, what have we here? Ah, the traveler, of course. Wallace said, yes, uh, right on time. Sorry you had to see that. But then again, you've been around. I'm sure you know. Families fight. Andrew Ford. Good to make your acquaintance. As in founder in Ford? Flesh. I thought you were a camp player oh, story. As real as a toothache. I'm sure you've got a lot of questions, and I've got a favor to ask. So let's get to it. You first. If you're really the Ford that built this place, how are you alive? You're over a hundred years That's old. That's a longer story than I can indulge right now. Let's keep it to this. You know how some things you drink can make you drunk? And some things you eat can make you sick or sleepy? Well, other things do this. It's a big world out there. Can I get huh. some? <laughs> Not my way. And you want to be careful what you wish for, traveler. So you were expecting me? Uh, not you precisely, as in name, rank, serial number. But I knew someone was coming. Love that purchase. Aren't you clever? Skeptic. That's fine. It so happens I knew you'd be coming today. Or I hoped. Our young Wallace told me. How would Wallace, Wallace know? He's a special kid. A lot like somebody I used to know. She had bad dreams, too. Dreams about things that hadn't yet come to pass. He can see the future? More like he can see really far into the present. Sometimes. Okay, so oh, favor. Nothing too dangerous. I've got to marshal my resources. And then we'll get into it in earnest. All right, well done. All right, traveler. Now that you've shot your shot, here's mine. I need an able young scrapper to help an old man out. Talk to Wally. You'll find him out by the docks. After oh, that, okay. gear up, and then meet me at the ward gate. I tell you a story. Ooh, what's this? Something I don't have a code for, I'm guessing. That is the wrong spot, because I'm already lost in this place. Uh, map. I this way. I just realized it'd be nice if you told me where the docks were. Greetings. <laughs> Forgive me, I am not... Ooh, who are you? It is new. I thought I had seen it before. So difficult to tell packs to take apart without hoof and horn. I am Sa Israk Thadwell. Uh, my Paxel tech name is Dwell. Yeah, the Paxel tech name. crystals from my world. They make Paxel tech faster, stronger, more powerful. They help it defeat its enemies. And the prices are quite fair. Interesting. Crystals that the Ahane would keep for themselves. Interesting. Not that Either I can way, buy anything. Dwell is here to find. Oh, this looks like a dock. Yeah, that, that would have been nice to have before. Hey, Wallace, what do you got for me? You look sleepy. I see you, traveler. Uh, I see you too. You're the one Ford's been waiting for. Though, he doesn't know he's been waiting. He thinks he needs help. It's her who needs it. Yes. And you don't. Sorry, I shouldn't say. Things get messier when I tell them. I'm Wallace. Did I say that yet? Probably. The sight, you know? <laughs> a 
Sorry, I probably said that already too. I'm not sure what's going on. Path to walk. You choose the first step here, but your path can change if you wanted to. Oh, this is where I get the archetype. Okay. So medic healing support, well-rounded. Looks like I get some kind of a shotgun. Skills, wellspring. Healing shield. Redemption, not my style. Hunter, this is what that kind of was last time. Range damage, precision shots, and marking enemies. Hunter mark, really liked that one last time. Hunter focus, continuously aiming down sights uninterrupted without shooting for one second causes the hunter to enter focus state. Focused reduces weapon spread, recoil, and sway by 75%, grants 25% range and ranged weak spot damage, and 10% ranged crit. I really like that. While focused aiming at enemies will automatically apply mark last 20 seconds. Focus state can last up to 10 seconds after the skill duration expires. Interesting. Hunter Shroud. Hunter becomes shrouded, reducing enemy awareness, making them harder to hit while moving. Attacking or activating a mod or skill will instantly exit Shroud. Exiting Shroud applies mark to all enemies within 10 meters. Hand grants ambush to the hunter for 2 seconds. Ambush increased range and melee damage by 50%, which diminishes over its duration. I really like that. And what's dead to rights? Hunter can extend the duration of their active skills by dealing a range to weak spot damage. I like what they did with Hunter. But let's see this other stuff. Close combat, no. Andor gets a puppy. This is what Zug Zug said he was gonna be though, so I'm not gonna do that. But see what he gets. He's gonna be a tank. Puppy's gonna be a tank. Interesting. And deal extra damage, okay. Gunslinger seems like it's going to be ammo conservation and instantly reload firearms. Him and medic. Okay, yeah, we're going on. Yeah. That makes a lot of sense now. <laughs> and that gets me armor. Okay. Seems like it's the right, right path. Course. Your path is waiting. Tell Brabus and McCabe I sent you. They have what you need. They're the next step on your journey. Till next time. All right, Night Stalker stuff. That's kind of what we had last time, I think. Now McCabe is the person who did mods, I believe. But where is she? Also traits, uh, expertise, skill cooldown. One of these is new. Increase weapon ideal range. Let's do that. Can I not do that? I have to be level two, okay. Yeah, I, I can't do that, okay, so. Why are those locked? Hunter archetype trade. Yeah, so we're just gonna put that to expertise for now. Commit changes. Yes. Ravis. And McCabe. Ooh, I wonder if I can make a, a decent trap out of that one. Well, ain't you a right mutter? Traits in in here like you own the place. Next step on my journey. What talks <laughs> the route? <laughs> I don't trust Wally with a hot meal, but I also ain't dumb enough to cross him. I don't reckon <laughs> Probably more good specific. idea. Said you knew what I needed. <laughs> right. Well, the boy's crazy, but he ain't stupid. And I can see your gear is uh, lacking, to say the least. If he asks, you tell him I gave you this. Uh, no charge. Ah, Riggs is gonna talk my ear off if I don't send you over to him next, isn't he? Fine. Go see Riggs then. Tell him he can do whatever the hell he wants. Interesting. Okay, so it's I for this. I wonder if I can make a, a decent trap out of that one. Mm. So they changed this out. So long gun got changed from a rusty lever action to a hunt master. Okay. We still do have to talk to uh, McCabe. I'll do her next, if I can get to her. She's grown up a bit. I swear to God and my mother. Did Bo send you over here, or did you stumble your way over here yourself? Actually, it was Wally. He said you could help me with my journey. <laughs> You're serious, aren't you? All right, so 
What the hell is this journey? I don't know. I swear. If that boy weren't so goddamn right all the time, he and I'd be having words. Percussive ones. <laughs> Fine. I like her. Well, the only reason anyone bothers me is because I'm good with a hammer. So either I can modify your weapons, or we can find a more creative use for it. <laughs> Tell you what. I heard you picked up something strange on your little jaunt earlier. Maybe I could do something with it. Yep. All right. Healing shot. Concussive shot. Fires a focus blast of air through all targets within eight meters. Scrap shot, caltrops, or hot shot. I like hot shot. So I can buy the rest of those that I didn't that, get. Okay. That ought to help with whatever journey he saw you on. Just tell Wally to be more specific next time. Yeah. <laughs> so we're done here, right? Or do I need the hammer again? No, we're, we're done. Oh. It's a miracle. <sighs> Look, it's not personal. I just don't like being distracted. I get into a zone, you know? Pisses nope, me I get it. People come by and interrupt my me time. But I'll tell you what. You're clearly not the average stray that shows up here. So I'll make you a deal. You find anything interesting out there, bring it back to me and I'll see if I can use it to mod your weapons. Okay? Right, oh, and if you tell anyone I was nice to you, I will cut you. <laughs> all right, what's Riggs got oh, for us? Friend. Glad to see you're all right. What can I do for you? Thanks for your help Riggs. back there, uh, Riggs. And no worries. There was a time when helping each other survive was all we had left. Around here, we don't forget those days if we can help it. Your friend's going to be all right, by the way. I've seen Weka pull out of worse. What were you doing out there? Uh, you don't mind me asking. We were looking for the word. What'd you hear exactly? Tales about a man who fights through and never ah, ages. Founder Ford's tales travel far and wide, don't they? Fair warning, you can't believe half of them. But half of impossible is still a sight, eh? Grab a stud to come here? He was more particular about why. He said you were gonna talk his ear off. <laughs> Yeah, that sounds like Bravis. Right. Well, I've got a pretty focused skill set. I reckon I know what he means. Come to me if you ever need to upgrade your equipment. Gotcha. So, with that being said, let's do the Huntmaster. Because I like sniping. You know where to find me. And now, I think I can talk to guy at the door. Oh, I didn't notice this only had a seven round equipment out of ten. It's worth it. Now you look like you could help an old man take on the world. <laughs> you ready to do this? You then let's bet. not waste any more time. This way. Just crank the handle to make it work. This used to be a research facility, cutting edge. We did things down here nobody dreamed of. Not before nor since. Yet, for all our manpower, we didn't know what the stones really were. Until it was too late. The stones? <laughs> the world stones. Giant red crystals that let us see into other worlds, even travel to them. So, what? We just hide the stones away and hope the Soviets haven't found their own. <laughs> no, we had to know everything there was to know about them. <laughs> it was a matter of national security, of pride. So, yeah, we opened the door. And walked through. 
Yeah, it sounds like a good idea. It didn't happen right away. Hell, the inhabitants of the worlds we traveled to couldn't follow us. We thought we were safe. But yeah, the route found a way. After that, well, huh. we all know what happened after that. Locked, huh? Well, this is my house. <laughs> Come on. I Old gave man can a few it. things to hang on to in case of emergency. Uh, she must have hidden it around here some. Come on, Ellie, where'd you hide it? Am I supposed to be finding something here? Ooh, dragon heart in that a matchbook. Thing, we call it a dragon heart. <laughs> Don't ask why. Take it with you. You might need it. Lovely. Come on, let's go. There you are. Hurry up. Hey, take a look at that matchbook you found. I got a hunch. Let's get this door unlocked. Can't stand around all day. It would be nice if you just gave me the key. Is that the... The world stone. Yes. Or part of it anyway. Every shard's as useful as the whole. We shut it down after Harsgard died. Like I told Ellen at the time. The damn thing's more dangerous than useful. Huh. Of course not. Uh, never mind. Of course he has something like that. Now, let's see if that worked. Work to do what exactly? Yep, of course he turned it on. Holy shit. Imagine seeing that for the first time. Being told to travel to other worlds. So many years. So many journeys. And being told it was the cause of the end of the world. Who first touched this crystal? Did he ever come back? Go back. Tell Bo to bury this place. Not just lock it away, but get some explosives and bury it in a tomb of concrete. More dangerous than useful, traveler. Remember that. And yet he's traveling. Ford? Ford! Ford! Oh man. Bo is gonna be pissed. Yeah. Huh. That bastard did it. He actually woke it up. Clementine? Hey. Did he tell you how to use it? Do I even want to? System failure is imminent. The core has been compromised. The utility is required. Commencing acquisition. Oh. No! Help! Clementine! <laughs> Don't let go! Now that's new. No, slipping! Don't let it take me! Don't you do it! Yep, oh, be a dumb. So <laughs> I do it too. Session is now joinable. Elder armor. Radiant armor. Void armor. Survivor pack. 
think that's from the uh, pre-order stuff. So we're gonna cut here, and Zuck will join us shortly. So, with that being said, so see you soon. And if not, this will be the end of the episode because it is actually getting really long for a starter episode. So as always, I wish you all well. I'll see you next time. And please have a good one.